Today, we're going through every single year of LEGOs to see which LEGO set is the best in history. Starting off with 1960. These are what the LEGOs used to look like. Look how tiny these boxes are, dude. I know, dude. They're like a deck of cards. It's like a pilot, and they built a little plane, and he's with his family. Aww. They have like pictures on here. This is like so cool. Let's open these bad boys up. You slide it open, and that is what you get. Wait, mine's already built. Yo! Homie super glued the pieces. No way. Bro, I literally can't rip them off. Okay, there it is, there it is. Take my wheels. Now I have nothing. Wait, that's all you had? Yeah, that's all I came with. <laughs> so one funny thing I just noticed is that some of these Lego pieces do not actually stay on. Like normally, when you put a Lego on something, it stays there, right? These ones just fall right off. I mean, I will say these Legos look exactly the same. Yeah, they didn't change much, did they? Let's fast forward 10 more years. In the 1970s, this is one of the first universal building sets. Check this out, boys. Yo, big upgrade. And we have not an instruction manual, but an idea book. And then they just give you a bunch of random pieces and you can let your mind explore. Dang, what should we build? You know what? We don't even need the instruction manual. Let your mind roam. I'm gonna build a car man. I'll build a house plane. I'm gonna build a tree. Oh, wow. Dude, this Whoa. green piece is thick. Ow. Yeah. Car man. It just looks like a dude on a skateboard. You wanna see him do a trick? Yeah, that's kind of fresh. Let me see that. Oh. Ah, no, his hand. Yo, listen to the sound of his skateboard grinding. Ready? You just killed him. Homie just died. To the 1980s. Moving on to the 1980s, we have a pirate ship. This is pretty insane compared to the previous Lego sets. They started to theme them, and the detail is just insane. <laughs> What was it me? Crazy fact about this one, this is actually one of the best-selling Lego sets of all time. We're gonna see if we can make it float. What? Legos can't float? <laughs> they can if <laughs> you put an RC car on the bottom. It's gonna float. Wow. It will. For um, extra stability, I have a pool noodle. We can wrap it around the side. Y'all figure out how to put the pirate ship in the boat. I'm gonna start measuring and cutting this. Oh, are you keeping them round like this, or are you gonna cut them in half? Should I? Buoyancy boy? I don't think it matters, dude. It still floats. Why am I buoyancy boy? Permission to dock. Permission granted. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna hit the throttle. Oh, look at that, it's going! Yeah! We made it work. Yo, Jack Sparrow would be proud. Lego sets are only gonna get better from now on. In 1980s, this is one of the first Lego Technics. This is when things start getting advanced. Like we have a claw here and we have like electrical wires and all these cool things, but unfortunately, this thing doesn't work. So unfortunately, we can't do anything cool with it. So that's why I decided to buy a brand new Lego Technic that does work. You have to pump it full of air, all of these tubes fill up, and then you can Look at that. To demonstrate its abilities, we're gonna make James a hot dog. So step one, I have to pick up the dog. Oh. Okay, okay. Now we just gotta drop the dog. Nice. Yes, 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 yes. Oh yes, yes, yes. Now let go of the dog. Yes, yes! We have successfully catch up and mustard the dog. All right, James, open that mouth. Here it comes. It's not the prettiest hot dog, but it is a hot dog. Here, you want me to lower it for you? Uh, yeah. There, there oh, it is. Oh, there it is. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll pick it back up. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> God, that's a well-dressed dog right there, bro. I didn't even cook it, it's a roll. <laughs> <laughs> In the 2000s, Legos got remotes. Remote controlled, that is. This is a train, and this thing is sick. We're gonna see uh, how fast this thing goes. Let's go. Oh. oh my gosh. Derailed. Now we're gonna make the train go even faster. Now we're gonna try to park the train in this garage, and the train is all the way up there. 
it went in the garage. Actually, it just, it just took the entire garage off the house. 2010, Lego released the Icon series. We have this Concord plane. This thing is actually insane. It's very, very detailed. The front nose even comes down like the real plane. And then if you pick it up, look at this. The landing gear actually folds up. How are you doing that? This is obviously an airplane, so I figured that we would make it fly. So where should we put these? You think like up here? Oh yeah, get that, get that crest, get that crest. We got everything hooked up on this bad boy. Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit nervous because uh, I don't know what this thing's gonna do. It could turn around and do a 360 and come right at us. I, I don't really know. Gabe, you ready? I think so. James, you ready? Yeah, <laughs> I'm ready to jump in the water. So the tricky thing about this is we all have to press our button at the same time. On go. Okay. In like three, two, one. Go! <laughs> oh my gosh! Bro, it actually flew though! There is uh, pieces everywhere, all over the ground. It obviously went straight into the water, but like for a split second, it kind of flew. It was, it was hauling. <laughs> it was, was crazy. That was freaking crazy. <laughs> The Ultimate Collector's Edition 8080. This is one of the most famous Lego builds. I think we can all agree on that. The level of detail, you can lift everything up and see the inside. You broke it! Oh, you can see all the inside parts over oh. here. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, dude, they got seats inside. As you know, these things are pretty destructive. They got lasers, they got crazy things, they got big legs that step on buildings. So we're gonna try to destroy that building right there. Oh, so it moves? No, I don't, 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 I don't think it moves. But it does have these crazy laser guns right on the front. So if we angle them down, they should be able to shoot right at the building. When I touch this button, you ready? The big red button? Laser, the lasers don't work. I got an idea. Uh, I have this RPG. All right, I'm just gonna act like I'm the AT, AT. Here, let me hit your button. Right, you ready? Your button's right here. Three, two, one. Lesson learned, Legos are not very destructive. I'll trade you. Yeah, that's working good, dude. Yeah, dude. Oh, I did miss one guy. I missed one guy. The best Lego set ever made. But how strong are its legs? Just like in the movies, we're gonna see if we can take this thing down with a rope. They do it a lot faster in the movies. Oh! <laughs> It fell apart so easily. <laughs> One of the biggest Lego sets in history, and definitely the tallest, the Eiffel Tower. This thing is insane. Bro, I'm on a chair and it's still taller than me. But the level of detail, like all the little designs just going all the way up to the top of the tower is crazy. But here's the deal. You know what's better than one Eiffel Tower? Two Eiffel Towers. Who would have time to build that? And we're going to try to stack them on top of each other and make the tallest Lego Eiffel Tower in the history of history. So step one is we have to carefully oh, take this thing apart. Look at this piece, dude. It's freaking huge. Now grab that whole entire base and put it on this. Now we go to the next piece. I got it. I got it. I got it. It's in. It's in. No way. It actually fits perfectly. Yo, this is insane. It's so tall. The final piece. Here it goes. Yeah, there you go. Oy, oh, boy, oh, boy, no. boy, 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 oh, boy. Oh, no. This is not good. I'm just going to put it. I'm going to drop it up top, and whatever happens, happens. It's there. We technically just made the world's biggest Lego set to ever exist for approximately one second. Oh, bro! Oh, I, I wanted to save it um, for my room, dude. No! Bro! 